Elon Musk is starting his own artificial intelligence company, and the CEO of Google is warning society to get ready for the rapid progress of AI. Let's get into it. All right, guys, welcome back, and thank you all so much for being here. It is Julie here with Tip Ranks, and today we're discussing AI or artificial intelligence. We have updates on Elon Musk and his venture into a new AI company, plus some commentary from the Google CEO. We'll also be looking at a few stocks that are heading up this new space. Don't forget, if you enjoyed today's video, to make sure you hit that thumbs up button and that you're subscribed to the channel as well. And if you want to download the Tip Ranks mobile app, you can follow the links in the description down below. Now let's jump right into this news. Elon Musk is reportedly working on the launch of a new AI startup called XAI Corporation. The move will allow him to compete with ChatGPT creator OpenAI. Now, it is worth noting that Musk co-founded OpenAI back in 2015, but left abruptly in 2018. His startup, XAI, was incorporated in Nevada last month and has Musk as its sole director and Jared Burchell as its secretary. It is said that Musk is assembling a team of AI researchers and engineers for the new company. Now, this comes shortly after Musk signed an open letter that was calling for a six-month pause on the creation of AI systems. The open letter was backed by many tech leaders and said that powerful AI systems should be developed only once we are confident that their effects will be positive and their risks will be manageable. Therefore, they're calling on all AI labs to immediately pause for at least six months the training of AI systems more powerful than GPT-4. In a recent interview on 60 Minutes, we also heard from the Google and Alphabet CEO who weighed in on AI. Sundar Pichai warned that there has to be regulation. You're going to need laws. There have to be consequences for creating deep fake videos which cause harm to society. They also commented that the rapid development of AI is likely to impact every product of every company and society needs to adapt to it. So artificial intelligence is obviously a train that, while it may be briefly paused, will not be stopped anytime soon. So let's take a look at a few companies that are leading the pack, starting off with none other than Alphabet or Google. With a massive $1.35 trillion market cap, the Alphabet stock trades under the ticker GOOGL, currently priced at $105 per share. Now they are down 17% over the last 12 months, but year to date are up 18%. Now, Alphabet already uses AI and automation in virtually every aspect of their business, from ad and content promotion to spam filters, but they also have a subsidiary that is exclusively devoted to artificial intelligence. That subsidiary is DeepMind Technologies, and that is a team of scientists, engineers, ethicists, and more that are committed to solving intelligence to advancing science and benefiting humanity. The tech giant has been investing heavily in AI technology for years now, and in March, they launched their Bard AI chatbot, which is their rival to ChatGPT. Of course, the Alphabet stock is very well known, but it seems that hedge funds have been scooping up some extra shares lately. Hedge funds holdings have increased by over 27 million shares in this past quarter. We can see as the price of Google has gone down, the hedge fund holdings have increased. And naturally, the stock gathers a lot of attention from analysts as well. For a stock with 29 analyst ratings, it is pretty impressive that the Google stock comes in as a unanimous strong buy. The average price target comes in at $127, which would be an upside of 21% from current prices. Looking at the last couple of weeks, of course, nothing but buy ratings, ranging from an upside of 9% to a high of 52%. And of course, another tech giant getting a lot of buzz in the AI space is Microsoft. This is due to their partnership with OpenAI, who has ChatGPT. Under the ticker MSFT, trading at $287 per share, Microsoft is another behemoth in the tech space with a market cap of $2.14 trillion. Their stock is up just 3% this past year, but 20% year to date. Microsoft recently unveiled a new version of its Bing search engine, this time powered by ChatGPT. They said that the new Bing will be your co-pilot for the web, helping with better searches, complete answers, and a new chat experience. That is just the tip of the iceberg though, as their AI co-pilot can be found across a variety of their products. On the AI front, they have their Microsoft Security Copilot, Microsoft 365 Copilot, Azure AI, that Bing with the ChatGPT, and their Microsoft Viva Sales. 
Microsoft is said to be strongly positioned in the AI space. They are leading the way with some of this technology, and that is reflected in the crowd wisdom on tip ranks as well. While 13% of all portfolios hold Microsoft, when we look at the top investors, that goes up to 26%, and the best performing investors allocate over 11% of their portfolios to the Microsoft stock. And this is another tech giant that attracts a lot of analyst attention, with 32 current analyst ratings. And while it is not unanimous, it does still come in as a strong buy. With a price target of $300, the average upside would be about 4% from current prices. And we do have a wide range of price targets here with a low of 240 to a high of 411. Looking at our most recent ratings, we do have buys and holds ranging from a downside of 4.5% to an upside of nearly 10%. So those are two giant companies that are leading the way with the AI technology. Now, I don't want to make this video too long, but I do want to quickly touch on a couple companies that are supporting this AI surge. So with that, we're going to move over to the chip industry, starting off with NVIDIA. Their stock trades under the ticker NVDA. They are up 22% this past year and 50% in the last three months. NVIDIA is taking advantage of the AI boom as the demand for graphic cards increases. The high-end chip maker provides the massive processing power needed to run advanced AI applications, and they say that their most advanced AI platform, NVIDIA AI, brings those cutting-edge advancements to every organization. They offer the world's most advanced AI platform with full-stack innovation in computing, software, and AI models and services. The NVIDIA stock has a whopping 37 current analyst ratings. Looking at all analysts, it does come in as a moderate buy with an average upside of nearly 6%, and when we focus on top analysts, it becomes a strong buy with an upside of 8.5%. Of course, the stock has seen a lot of growth recently, but analysts still think there's some upside ahead. We have price targets ranging from an upside of 3% all the way up to 20%. Next, we have another company in this chip space that has had a bit tougher of a year, that is Micron. Trading under the ticker MU, the stock is up over 16% this past six months, but is down 11% over the past year. Similar to NVIDIA, Micron is working to help power this new generation of AI. Their fast, vast storage and high performance, high capacity, memory and multi-chip packages power AI training and inference engines, whether in the cloud or embedded in mobile and edge devices. Now, as I said, Micron has had a tougher go. At the end of March, they announced that they're expecting their third quarter revenue, which is due out at the end of June, will be declining 60% year over year. But this kind of was anticipated by analysts and they're looking forward to a brighter picture. In their latest quarterly report, they did report their largest loss on record with a loss of $1.91 per share. That came from an inventory write down of more than $1.4 billion but they did provide some positive future outlook. Their CEO indicated that the worst of the downturn is at hand and that they expect to see revenue growth in fiscal Q3 with data center customer inventories reaching relatively healthy levels by the end of calendar 2023. Of course, with this, we have a bit more divided opinions coming from Wall Street analysts. But overall, the stock does come in as a moderate buy with 25 analyst ratings and an average upside of nearly 13%. Down in our detailed list here, we can see the big range. We have some sell ratings with a downside of 26%, but our most recent rating comes in with an upside of 60%. So some differing opinions there. That is gonna be our quick overview of our few companies leading the way in the artificial intelligence space. Of course, there are a lot of other great tech companies involved in AI. Let me know some of your favorites in the comments down below. You guys know I always appreciate hearing from you. Please keep in mind these videos are never a suggestion to buy or sell any specific stock and is just meant for entertainment and information purposes. So please make sure you're always doing your own research and due diligence. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day and I'll see you back here next time.